Thank you for coming. Of course. The chief, he's, uh, he, he's very... Maybe you could speak to him? Yes, yes. Why well, can't? He's in his tent. Joe. Sure. I'll wait for you here. Come in. <clears throat> Mr. Morgan. I'm so glad you could make it. How are you? My son. My son is foolish, but he's still my son. I know your son. A little. <clears throat> he's very brave. Very angry. <laughs> he's me. How is your father? He's dead a long time. I lived a lot longer than was good for any of us. My son probably wishes the same to me. <laughs> I doubt that. I want peace. I need my people to be safe. All my life I've tried to bring peace. But I love my son. They'll hang him for treason. Treason. He is the chief son of a proud nation. How could he commit treason? People who have lied to my people for a hundred years or more, that's treason. Well, friend, Mr. Vanderland, has ensured relations between us and the army are worse than any point in the last five years. I'm sure he means well. But matters are more complex than he understands. Me and Charles will try and rescue your son. No. Yes, yes. I ain't got much to lose, and you got... I'm doing this. Charles! Where are you? Come on, let's go. I need to get his son back, of course. I just ain't sure how. I've been working on that. I think there's a way. Follow me. 